Hey, what's going on everybody? Servo here. Welcome back to the channel. Today, I'm going to teach you about like an infinite health exploit, something that is literally going to help you defeat any of the bosses in the game or even just defeat any of the minions and have a much easier way of going through the world of Core Keeper. Now, this is something that is definitely broken and I'm going to show you a more advanced version and a little bit later into the video that's going to take it to some really broken limit so make sure you stick around and watch the whole thing but i have a basic character right here with just 100 health so i'm going to show you how this works at its base and then show you how it works on a more advanced character if you guys do enjoy any of my content or any of my core keeper content please be sure to hit that like button subscribe to the channel i plan on uploading lots of guides for core keeper and uh, yes we did get a hot fix today but this did not get patched. They did patch the whole dynamite packs exploit where you get unlimited ancient coins. That did not take long. So that's why I always recommend make sure you guys subscribe so you know about this stuff and can take advantage of it before it's patched. But let's jump into it. So what we're going to do is I have a full health here, right? Like I have 100 health. If I look over here, my health is at 100 max. I don't have any health regen at all. So to do this little exploit, all you have to do is uh, sleep in a bed. I'm gonna have to sleep in this one. I have another character on that bed. Uh, all you have to do is go and sleep in a bed. So when your character looks like this and you're sleeping, just save and exit the game, okay? So now that we're loaded back in, up here we actually have a plus two percent health every second buff this will not go away now until your character dies so that is the exploit but like i said you can take this far beyond just getting two health every second so we're going to start at low and uh if we go over here you see now it says 2.0 health every second we definitely did not have that before so let's go find a mob real quick that can uh, do some damage to us all right here we go so let's let this one hit us a little bit hit us again hit us one more time there we go so we're at 24 health 26 28 30 32 34 it's going up by two so that is awesome and again this buff is permanent so it's like i have eaten food even though i have it so you could take items like let's look at this worm necklace here it says 1.6 health every second that's actually going to round up to two so now i'm regenerating four health every second by just adding that so for as long as my character doesn't die I have something that's going to regen me for health every second, which is very, very quickly. Now, this also goes into your skills, your other equipment. If you have a bunch of different skills um, under like the vitality aspect, one that there's one down here that'll like give you plus 6% more healing from health over time regeneration. This works. So I'm going to go on my uh, end game character and show you how much I'm regenerating. All right, so here's the cool thing. I did it on my main character. I have the plus 2% health every second. So uh, I have an overall right now, my health is sitting at 1,536. And my health every second is 39.9. Well, actually, if I put my necklace back on, it's going to be higher. So right now, I have 42 health every second. So this thing will automatically trigger that when I take some damage as well. So if I go down here to my little mob farm and let them do some damage to me, you're going to see that I'm going to be regenerating that much health constantly. So it's absolutely crazy how much health I can end up getting. There we go. All right, so I'm all the way down to 900, 800 health. And then look how fast I can be regenerating this. And I haven't even consumed any food. If I were to consume food like I have here, it's going to be even faster. So this is 12.2 health every second for 26 seconds. Look, my health is already full again. So this time I'm going to let them damage me. And this is not the best food, by the way. This is just what I have in my inventory at the time. So... There we go. We'll take some more damage. We'll let him get us pretty pretty low. I'm going to eat the food. And now it's even faster. So if you pair this up with different types of armors and accessories and rings and everything. So like over here, I have the healing potency maxed out. It's plus 30% more healing from health over time regeneration. And uh, my health is already full. So imagine being in a boss fight and you eat, have this much health. I can constantly refill my health over and over very quickly in the middle like of the duration of a fight you also have a bunch of just random skills here that you can invest in like gain one 
uh, plus one health every second while below half max health. So that right there is going to allow me to go even faster. So yeah, this is definitely something that's, I would say, game breaking and it's something you could definitely take advantage of. Now, the developers are a small team, but... They have been working very hard on making this game, you know, nice and polished for everybody. So I definitely wouldn't be surprised if they get this fixed very quickly. It's not a bad thing. The, the thing about these kind of games is it's just so fun, the journey, you know, like this is how it is for every game. When a game comes out, there's always some bugs and stuff. And it's great that we as a community share these things around, make videos on it, talk about it in discords and stuff. It's just one of those like classic gamer things is you take advantage of a little exploit and it's really fun for a little bit and then it gets polished we also help the developers with that but we also get to have our fun with it as well so i think this one's pretty pretty harmless you know it's one of those things you know they have mods implemented in the game so i don't think the developers care too much if you use some explo uh, exploits like this they've always been more of like play how you want to play but they also want to have their game nice and polished too so i don't think they're punishing the players by uh patching anything especially like the dynamite pack situation that definitely needed to be patched because oh my gosh the amount of ancient coins you could get was actually crazy so i hope this helps you out especially if you've just been struggling with the game a little bit and uh remember if your character does end up dying you're gonna have to reset that but all you have to do literally is go and sleep in the bed save and log off now i was not the finder of this uh th this exploit at all i actually don't know who was because i've seen it passed around everywhere reddit discords you know like it's been passed around a lot lately so if i ever do find out who it is i will update at the comment section below but i will tell you i am not the one that found this so it's just really cool and i'm sure there's plenty of more ex like really amazing glitches and exploits out there and i'll definitely keep you guys updated on this but yeah see what you guys can do uh try to get your health regen up i'm sure there's a full health regen build you could do if you wanted just like super fast healing this one uh, i actually usually use this armor set over here and then i like to use armor out rings just for the extra damage against the boss Plus, you get five life on melee hits. So even though I'm taking damage, I'm going to be... Uh, when I'm dealing damage, I'm going to be getting even more health back. So that's really cool. So uh, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you guys have an amazing day. And I'll see you guys in the next one.